found it provides a new and I think extremely alarming phenomenon. <laughs> Ever since 1979, when Ayatollah Khamenei came to power in Iran and established his theocracy, he didn't just establish a tyranny in Iran, he declared war against the West. He declared his intention to Islamize the West, to subjugate the West to Islam. Very few people at the time took that seriously. The followers of Ayatollah Khomeini shocked the world by taking over an American embassy and holding our State Department employees hostage for 444 days. And what that was was a statement against the West, a statement against America, and making it clear to their population and to all the Islamists of the world that theocratic Islamism stood against American liberty and Western freedom. We know that the Iranian government is working uh, very hard to uh, develop a nuclear weapons program as well as other kinds of uh, weapons of mass destruction. I would regard this as a real danger at the present time. The acquisition of nuclear weapons and their control by Ahmadinejad. MAD won't work with uh, Ahmadinejad um, because mutual assured destruction for one of his mindset is not a deterrent, it's an incentive. Um, it, this is the final struggle, the end of time. It doesn't matter if you kill billions of your own people, Allah will know his own and you will be doing them a favor by giving them a quick pass to heaven and all its delights. Um, that's why I feel that if he has it, or when he has it, to be more precise, he will not hesitate to use it.